Anyways, I want to show you my mine. Well, hi, baby. Um, I've done a lot of digging. So if you guys think that we're not playing legit, well, this should answer your question. Lesser Sagoff? Shogoff? Interesting. Hey, welcome back, guys. Today, we are picking right off, picking up where we left off with our Abyssal Craft stuff. So, I did, oh, good grief. Let me tell you, okay? So, I've got a lot of these shards and fragments and all that stuff. Let's just say you don't get one every time you kill one. So, I, it took a while. It took a long while. See, I've got, what, uh, 128 plus 30... 158, 159, 60, 161, 161 plus 29 of those. I don't, not to mention all the ones that didn't die. It was absolute madness, I tell you. But fortunately, I didn't have to do any mining, right? Because I already had them all. And you know what? I need to bring some of that stuff with me. Because we need to make the last uh, three of these guys right here, the transmutation gems. And then we'll wrap them up in these things and we'll get the shards and we'll have everything we need to make everything we need for the uh oh i just thought about something i'm gonna need one more of these cr i gotta go i gotta go mining some more i didn't even think about that i i made let me show you what i did okay i i literally i hadn't even thought about it when i had done it and it's been oh probably about a day or two now um i hadn't thought about it i made three more of the or two more of those uh little charging pedestals or whatever so that way I had three of these books going or three of the Necronomicons going. And then that way I just have like, you know, a lot of power, like the, a lot of the PE as they say it or potential energy. And I had to use two more of those things to do that. Oh goodness. Well, I guess this is not too bad. I'm going to go ahead and head over to uh, where I was mining and you guys can kind of see uh, where I have been mining, trying to get this stuff. It's, it's pretty nuts how much, I've actually done. Um, well, when we get there, you'll see. It's it's pretty crazy. All right, guys. So I was uh, heading. We're we're heading. Where to go? Over there to my ocean mine, right? But I was uh, cruising by, and I just wanted to show you how much mining it takes to get some of this stuff, and some of these uh, shadow monsters. Like you can see a whole bunch of them right there that I'm about to pick off some more because we're going to need some more of these shadow gems eventually, and. Uh, Ooh, come on. There we go. Because we need all those shadow shards we can get and those big ones right there. Because it takes a lot. Hey, leave me alone. Anyways, I want to show you my mine. Well, hi, baby. Um, I've done a lot of digging. So if you guys think that we're not playing legit, well, this should answer your question. Um, this has all been cleared out by my awesome blood magic pickaxe. And uh, it's it's pretty freaking studly. I've taken out a lot of this. And honestly, the reason this is so big was I came back looking for Curlium Gems at one point, And I forgot that they're actually in the ocean mine, not in this one. And so I cleared this boy, bad boy out pretty, pretty major. But anyways, we're going to head over to the ocean mine. And we'll be right back when we get there. All right. So we have found our ocean mine. And check this out. Another anomaly. I, I don't even think I noticed that the first time I came through here. But this is the ocean mine right here. And if we just drop in. Oh, I don't have my sigil suppression turned on. Hmm. Let me fix that real quick. Where you at? Sigil suppression. Boom. There we go. And this is how I did the ocean mine. Wandered down here. Just started clearing blocks out while I was down here. And I've done a lot here too, as you can see. Lots and lots and lots of mining. And so hopefully we're going to be really lucky and we're going to find some of these gems right off the bat. Because I believe you just have to be in the deep ocean. I don't believe you have to be in any specific spot. So we're going to maximize and actually dig in. Two, three. Oh, wow. What are the what, what, what are the odds? Oh, look at that. Get quite a few. Um, What don't I need? I don't need gold, uranium, tritanium. Um, shiny, I do. Abyssinite, definitely need that. 
Uh, what do I have too much of? Um, silver. I don't need silver. And I definitely don't need basalt. There we go. So we only need a couple of these for right now. Hold on, I'm gonna maximize this dig though. So one, two, three, four, five, six, and do a little right clicky. And no more of those, but let's go this way now. One, two, three, four, five, six. Just maximizing the dig here. Oh, 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 oh. <clears throat> well, that's good enough. I, I'm not overly worried about it right now because all I wanted was to get a couple of these. I've got 15. Um, and I believe I only needed nine, right? So, uh, we should be good. We should be good. Now I just gotta remember how to get out of this thing. Cause, well, let's just go this way. Make sure I'm not doing this hastily and killing myself here. Oh, I got plenty. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. No? Where is my exit out of here? I mean, obviously, it's not going to be the exact way I'm just going, but it's going to be in here somewhere. We want to get back, and we want to get this awesome stuff going. Uh, oh, yeah, this is the exit. Here we go. I'm going to just fly right up. Oh, it's so awesome. So awesome. Little hole of water right there, and just fills right back in as I leave. Little manta ray. All right, cool. So we're gonna head back home, and uh, when we get there, we should have charged up all those things enough that we should be good to go. So we'll be home in a second. All right, figured I'd uh, dump my inventory real quick while we're here. Forty-two diamonds. I would say that uh, that last trip was kind of worthwhile, and I could have thrown all that cobblestone in there, but it's okay. Uh, some fragments got you iron spikes that was really cool i found uh, some chance cubes while i was there and yeah all right so here we go so we're gonna go ahead and piece all you guys together and i'm gonna grab you and you and you and then we're gonna need some blaze powder i'm gonna need what four eight sixteen four eight twelve wow i can't even i can't math right now uh, blaze. Oh, that's only got 13. So, fortunately, I got a couple extra blaze rods, right? So, we're going to actually grab those blaze rods. And, oh, I put the epistle knight. I didn't mean to do that. There we go. I'm going to grab all you. There we go. Blaze, blaze. Now, we're going to piece these bad boys together here. We made, found quite a few actually. And there you go. Let's make as many as we can here. Because I think all I ever have seen these used for is these things right here. All right, so, wow, I'm still gonna need more. That is so sad. Because I need, how many of these? I need four, eight, 16, 12, 16, I need 16 of these. So I'm going to have to go kill more mobbies. Um, I, shoot. I may go do that right now. I may go back over the Darklands and just start smoking some mobbies until I get enough of those. Because if I find the big guys, the big guys drop these. And uh, then it's not too bad. But uh, first, we'll go ahead and run these rituals. Make sure how much power I got from these guys. This one's got 23. Let's see. This one has... 35 okay so we got more than enough uh oh shoot i forgot to grab the ender pearls and stuff so we're gonna make those up you know what i'm, sure I'm just gonna go kill mobbies and uh then we'll be back all right just got back from killing some mobbies got everything we need and i think we should be good i think we should be able to make um oh shoot i never did craft the things that's what i didn't do i need the stone so i can craft the last little uh, pearl guy because I'm going to need two. Ooh, whoa, 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 whoa. Chill out. Um, stone, 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 stone. All right, well, we'll just grab this. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, cool. So we're going to make the last uh, pearl, and then we should have enough, right? 
So I've got, f I need three more for the little red gem thingies. And I need two for the actual key. And then we should be good. And then we should be able to take a trip over to the abyssal world, which will be awesome. Absolutely awesome. I'm excited. I don't know what to expect there. I read a little bit about it and it basically said take food. So <laughs> I don't know what exactly that has to do with anything, but it did say take food. So we will see. And let me craft up one of these red gems just to make sure I got the recipe right. It was one of these and four of these, right? Yes. Okay. Shard of Oblivion. Cool. We need three more of those. So once we get this gem, we should be good. All right. So you guys went like this. Oh, sorry. Got to do you first. Five of those. All right, and you guys go like that. There we go. And you'll cook up real quick like. Corillium infused stone gives us a Corillium pearl. Kind of a, I don't know, I, I, I would almost say an unnecessary extra step <coughs> to have to create those blocks, but whatever. It wasn't all that difficult. You just have to know where to find the stuff. And I think mining under the ocean is kind of crazy, but whatever. All right, making sure that pickaxe is turned off because I make that mistake a lot. All right, cool. So, ender pearl, ender pearl, diamond, diamond, blaze, 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 and blaze. Okay. And let me just move you real quick. Oh, wait, you know what? Let me turn you off. I got my compression stuff on. Um, no, you're off. You're on. There you go. You're the one that I wanted to turn off. There we go. And we'll go ahead and grab you and give it a little clicky click. Oh, no. You don't go there. You go there. And then I get a little shift clicky click, right? There we go. And this will give us our second one. And I wonder if I can just start setting up the next one. That'd be kind of funny. Okay, got you. So pearl, pearl, diamond, Diamond, blaze, 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 and blaze, and pearl goes in the middle, and there we go, and oh, we are so close, so, so close, we are going to be taking a trip to another dimension, I love new dimensions, but the funny thing is, I still have to learn what we can really even do in the dimension, I, I'm really not even 100% sure what happens in that dimension, so... That'll be something to uh, do a little studying before we uh, uh, really get going. But that'll probably be in the next episode. I don't see myself really working with much else right now. I think this will kind of be it um, for at least the next couple episodes because this, this mod seems very, very in-depth. There seems like there's a lot going on. So I think we're going to be working on it for a while. Um, okay, so what was it? It's... Well, let me put all these in. Oh, I gotta do it like this. Okay. Okay, take you, you, and you. And then I think it was redstone. And what went in the middle? Uh, like an eye of ender or something like that? I should probably look that up. Uh, where are you? Um, gate. Yes, gate key. You are right there. And it was this guy. And I have Ender. So I've got the Blaze. I just need to get one more Ender Pearl. Okay, cool. And then four Redstone. We got this. We got this. We got this. We got this. I'm not sure where I'm going to build the next portal. I, just, I think I'm just going to put it up on the roof because I think I'm going to incorporate that in uh, the same way I've done the bottom floor. Uh, we'll see. Redstone. I need four of you. And then I need one Ender Pearl. Oh, never mind. I already got an eye of ender. I don't even need the ender pearl. So we'll take you guys and head over. It's so deceiving. I always forget when I have my uh, night vision on because obviously I have my night vision on right now. And I tend to forget about that. So it gets kind of dangerous uh, at night. Okay, so uh, what was it? Uh, those in the corner, redstone's on the top and bottom. Okay. So, one, two, three, four, 
and then these oblivion crystals one two three four sweet and eye of ender in the middle <clears throat> and i think you're the most charged so we'll use you and shift oh 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 you little poison rat i love how they can't hurt me anymore because i don't take poison come on yes we've got this thingy now and now i should be able to make this little key you you and you blaze rods there oh yeah we've got the gateway key the undead key according to the achievement all right i'm thinking this portal is going to go up here so it says it just click on the ground um and then it's going to put the portal in so let's see i i think i'm hoping it's like a, a nether portal oh no because i'm all odd there um uh, I'm on an all odd build and it's going to be an even amount of blocks. That's going to bother me. That's going to really, really bother me. <clears throat> yeah, see, it's all different shaped. Um, well, heck, I guess we'll just click there. Oh, look at this. Look at this. We have a new dimension to go to. Um, I'm going to bring the Necronomicon. I don't want to bring anything else of value because I don't know what this, this dimension is all about. So let's go clear out some of our stuff real quick. And um, you, you, you. Um, I'm keeping you. Uh, is there anything of value in my golden bag of holding right now? Uh, a lot of red gems from Erebus. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, man, this whole time I had my vengeance pickaxe on me. Man. That Erebus stuff. Oh, I totally forgot about it. Okay. Well, we're going to leave you here. <clears throat> and we're going to leave you guys here and you here. I'm going to take my axe because we might need you. Um, I'm going to take that key because I'm not going to run into the same problem I did with uh, whatever that other mod was. Um, Erebus, not getting stuck again. <clears throat> and we are about to go check out another dimension. Let's go see what it has to offer. Here we go. Welcome to the Wasteland. Oh, that's cool. All right. Let's check out this place. Whoa. Okay, let me turn off my night vision. Yeah, I have a feeling it's going to... A lot of mobbies. Are you guys as easy to kill as Overworld? Yeah. Yeah, you guys are easy. All right. What do we got here? Ooh, look at that. Abyssal Corellium Ore. Okay, so we're going to be able to get stuff a lot easier here. Which is really, really cool. Look at all that. Oh, what's this bright liquid over? Is this just water? What is this? Um, I don't want to touch it because we're in a weird place. And weird place usually is weird stuff. Let's fly around and kind of check out this area. Oh, before I get too far, let me mark my portal on uh, the journey map. Don't want to get too far away. Yeah, of course I'm going to get that XP. Give me that XP. Yeah. See, that's how I wanted my portal to be. I didn't know if it was going to be above the ground or not. So I can always mine up the other one and fix that. All right, here we go. So don't shoot me. Oh, man, you're so annoying. Okay. Journey map. We want a new point right where I'm at. This is portal. And save. I'm going to go ahead and turn it off for right now. And I don't know. Whoa, this guy's pretty big. Who are you? You are a... What's your name, dude? Skeleton Goliath. Did you drop anything, like, cool? You dropped a bone. Like, really? This, like, mammoth guy called a Goliath, and he gave me a bone? And it takes three shots of my badass freaking gun to kill him well hey mr robot oh yeah we're gonna have to check this out because i i don't want to just be like you know shooting stuff i want to know what my reason for being here is Ooh, an android like a rain android like so i think oh more of these goliath guys i think we might oh hold on oh chance block gotta do the chance block here we go Let's walk. 
Oh, that was so close. That was so close. Thank you for flight. Oh, that was so scary. Okay. What's in here? Oh, what are you guys? What are you guys? Lesser Sagoff? Shogoff? Interesting. All right, guys. Well, I think we're going to go ahead and call it quits here. And then uh, next episode, we'll pick up really checking this area out and uh, finding out what else we can do. I think there's an end boss here. So I think there's something like uh, uh, similar to... What the heck is this? Oh, it's an arrow. Uh, similar to an Eye of Ender for this place where we throw it around and we find a little like dungeon or whatever to go fight a dude. So we're going to go ahead and do that in the next episode. But for right now, I'm going to try to keep this one a little bit shorter than normal because I'm actually just super excited that we found this place. So until next time, guys, uh, I'm Slutter Havoc. This is the Revenge of the Sea Team server. If you guys enjoyed yourselves, please leave a like or uh, a comment. Let me know how you enjoyed it, what else you want to see. And until next time, guys, I'm out of here. Peace.